Hi, this is Quant Namat. Welcome to my channel. So in um, this video, let's uh, look at um, indicators with protected code and what you can do with them. So the question is following. So for example, you purchased access to invite-only indicator or you found a public indicator with protected code and you want to adjust it to some extent. So for example, you, can, you want to create like alerts for it or you want to uh, create strategy to backtest it. And unfortunately, you cannot have, have access to the code, so you cannot adjust it your, on your own. You can try to, uh, of course, to contact the owner of the script and ask for this adjustment on, or probably just provide you with source code, but I don't think this will work often for you. So the question is what you can do on your own. So fortunately, Training you just recently announced a feature that can, can help you to some extent in this case. And in this video, I will uh, show you what can you do. So here, for example, I have a public strategy, but uh, code source code is protected, so I cannot just copy it and adjust it on, on my own. So let's go to uh, Train View, um, and I will show you what you can do. So uh, this feature I told you about is actually that you can use other indicators as a source to your own indicators and it can help you to work with uh, private indicators as well. So let's uh, create like a SRC variable and it will store um, source, it will be a source for our indicator and it should be a type of um, input uh, source. So let's just plot it for now and let's add it to our chart. So for now, it's um, plotting just close price for uh, for our Ethereum USD pair. But if you go to source code, to, to the parameters, you can select here source and you actually can select all lines plotted on other indicators that are currently on your chart. So here I can select actually the line from indicator with the closed code as well. So I can select it and now I have the same line on, on my chart in my script. And this means actually that you can create easily, can work uh, with this line in your script to uh, produce alerts or you produce signals or strategies, whatever you want. So now let's go and um, do something with it. So first of all, you can go and create like a signal. So if you have in your mind how uh, signals should look like, you can do this easily. So for example, let's create like a signal, a long signal that when price uh, crosses our uh, source, um, so basically uh, this uh, red line, it will be like a long signal and it will be short signal when um, uh, we have cross under here, so it's pretty simple. And what you can do now, actually you can easily create alerts based, based on it, so just create alert condition, uh, just use here like long as a message and a title long as well and you can do the same for short so it works pretty easily so let's just edit the chart again and here you should go and select uh, this uh, line you want to use just uh, press ok and after that you can go to alerts create alert select your script and here you can see two alerts based on indicators from your um, from your indicator with closed uh, code so it's as you can see it's quite simple and the same way you can do with strategy so just do a strategy and uh, go for it and just create like strategy entry function and this is, will be my long true and when will be your condition so just copy it for the short it will be this pretty much the same just Let's do this false here. Let's just edit again and you will see that strategy works very well as well. So just go in parameters and select your line you want to use. Press OK and here you can see this actually um, strategy based on indicator of with closed code. So it work pretty, um, pretty well and it's very easy to, to, to do that. But unfortunately, uh, you have some limitations to this approach. Uh, first one and the biggest one is that actually you can have only one input input of this of this type. So for example, on the, this chart on, on this indicator, you can see we have like two lines, 
and I can uh, use only uh, one of them. So if I will try to do uh, two lines, it, it won't work. So in your script, you can use only one indicator as, in, as an input. And this is a bit of a problem for some indicators. Another one is that as a source, you can use only, only a study, only an indicator. So you cannot uh, uh, use like strategy and uh, get some values from the strategy. It won't work for you. So this is also some sort of problem. So only indicators uh, can work with this approach. So I think that's all um, uh, for this video. Thank you for watching. See you.